Hey everybody, Justin Cener here. In this video, I'm gonna teach you how to add images and text to your product images to boost sales on your Shopify store. This is a really, really powerful technique that a lot of the big stores are using and it's all about using image overlays to boost your sales. And this is a strategy that is directly related to increasing your conversion rate, right? Making more sales, making more money with the same exact traffic that you have. And you wanna leverage product imagery as a conversion booster. And we're talking about using overlays on top of products. Popular examples are like badges where you show something like free shipping or bestseller or 50% off or something where you wanna differentiate uh, amongst a huge variety of products and really drive attention, kind of like driving a funnel for how you want people to view products in a collection page or view products amongst other products, really making things stand out. And again, being able to drive attention, being able to have those kind of graphic-based call-outs that are gonna help the customer identify the product that they want quickly and move them through that funnel, obviously, to the end of checking out and becoming a paying customer, increasing that conversion rate, right? That's why we're doing this. And in terms of pain points, there's no built-in way to do this with Shopify. You're gonna to need to use an app and I'm gonna show you exactly what I use. And the app must allow for product feeds to remain unchanged. So I wanna talk about that first. You have your product imagery that's gonna show up on the site. Then you might have something like the Google feed uh, or the Facebook feed they're using for ads or the Merchant Center on Google. And you wanna make sure that these have no badges on them, no promotional text on them. They're gonna get disapproved. It could even potentially block or ban your account for using images with badges and promotional text. So you need an app that's gonna first of all understand that there's a difference between the image that you show on the site and the image that you show in the feed. And that's a real big reason for wanting to use an app here and not just changing the image on the product side of Shopify because it's gonna change everything the feed included. So that's a big thing. Also, we wanna find an app that's incredibly easy to use. And I'm gonna show you over the shoulder just how easy to use this app is. Easy product image overlays. This is what I use for this task. This is what I highly recommend. You see the link directly below this video. And it's really all about having that individual control of being able to add badges like free shipping or percentage off or top sellers or adding promotional text on images, right? We're not gonna change the feed-based images. That's gonna remain the same. We're just gonna change the actual visual images on your storefront, both mobile and desktop. And it's going to be all done in one easy to use app. We're gonna go over the shoulder in a second. I'll show you more, but here's easy product image overlays inside of the Shopify app store. And you see over here, the link again, directly below this video, but you're gonna be able to quickly add image and text overlays to your product images. And we'll go over the shoulder, I'll show you the back end, but here's some screenshots, really easy. In this uh, case, we're adding a bestseller badge in this instance, right? And we could literally select different types of overlays. We could associate them with different products. And you see this one does not have it, this one has it, right? Very easy to use, and it's not gonna change the feed. So you'll really be able to differentiate those best sellers or those promotional items or items that you wanna get the most attention to. You could add overlays and call outs to them and generate a lot more eyeballs and a higher conversion rate. This is gonna look good on mobile as well. And you see that this is a app that is gonna be super easy to use. All you need to do is just press the install button right over here, this black button. I'm gonna press it as well. We'll go over the shoulder and I'll show you step-by-step -step how to use easy product image overlays. So once you press the install button, you'll be just brought over to this permissions page where you'll be able to press the install app button up here and get easy product overlays into your store. Once you finish that, you'll be brought into your easy app dashboard homepage. You'll see all your products over here. You can visit the plans section as well. Take a look at the different pricing plans over here, depending on how many products you have for the app, you'll be able to switch and upgrade at any time. But you wanna come over here and look at app instructions. All we need to do is set up a little bit of backend here for easy product image overlays. Super easy, I'm gonna show you exactly how to do this step by step. But they also have a great dev team that will handle this for you. All you need to do, you can just chat with them directly inside here. They'll be able to get everything set up for you. But I'm gonna show you, it's super easy. We're gonna get started right now. First things first, we wanna enable the app in our theme. What we're gonna do is come over here and enable the embed extension. So we just click here, it's gonna bring us into our theme editor. And you'll see that we'll be able to enable this once this loads here. You see easy overlay settings and we're simply gonna enable and then save. Okay, so that's step number one. We can come back over here with step one done. We're gonna to go to step two. And here you're gonna select either Shopify theme 1.0 if you have an older theme, maybe minimal for example, or Shopify theme 2.0, this is a newer one. 
Dawn is the most popular one. That's what I'm using in this store. And we're gonna follow these step-by-step -step instructions in order to get this set up in our theme. So for most of you that have a new store, you're gonna be doing 2.0. If you have an old, old theme, you can go with 1.0, follow the instructions for there. And again, you could email their support team over here, dan at summitwebconsultants.com. They have great free dev support. They'll be able to install this code in here for you, but it's super easy. I'll show you exactly how I did it. So I'm over here in the theme code editor for product uh, thumbnail.liquid. And right over here in approximately uh, line 53, added the uh, snippet of code that was instructed in terms of doing that. So just follow the instructions, or again, you could email the support team and they'll do it for you. Now that I've got it all installed, we'll come over here into the home section. And now we can actually get to work in terms of creating our product image overlays. And what you're gonna see here is a list, a searchable list of all of your products. And let's say we wanted to go ahead and take one of our more popular products, this Ejecto Cedo product. We'll come over here and click Manage Overlay. You'll see that each product has its own man, uh, Manage Overlay button. And as you could imagine, what we're gonna be able to do here is manage or create and edit different overlays in terms of how we want to set things up. And I'll show you a really nice, simple, easy one to get started. You see the different options over here. We'll click Add Text Overlay. And you're gonna see now we have, of course, some text fields and some formatting options. So how about I put something over here, I'll say top seller, and we can say, let's make it uh, 16, and we could set, let's try a different, uh, let's try a funny font over there. Let's come over here, we'll pick uh, maybe, let's pick a green. Okay, something like that. Okay, we could align it. We can do positioning over here, so we can move it to bottom right. I think bottom left is gonna make a little bit more sense. We can have some padding as well. So you'll see that this is just basically moving the positioning a little bit. As we increase this, you know, to the right or to the left, you see how it's moving. I like to give it a little bit of space over there. Scale in terms of the product over here, and we can go up or down up to zero through 100 in terms of how big this image, or in this case, the text is gonna be. Collection as well in terms of this is the product page, the collection page, the search page. You know, we can go into in terms of different sizes, go a little bit smaller on these collection pages just because there's a lot of them in there. And you can play around with the positioning and, you know, you could have different uh, call outs for each kind of thing. You can kind of consider these badges that uh, product, products can earn, for example, top seller or a great gift. Things like that can be added in different sections to give additional call outs in there. So really, really easy. And then when you save your first overlay, of course, it's gonna come down over here in terms of the overlay list, where you'll be able to go ahead and edit it, you can view it, you can remove it as well, right? You can see all the different options that we set inside here. And let's say we want to come over here and say, okay, let's actually go ahead and pick a, uh, you know, maybe a more serious font. We can go with Monaco and go with that. And we'll be able to have our list of overlays in here again. So you see it updated a little bit over there. And uh, now we're gonna do an image overlay. So the same thing we're gonna do over here, we have instead of the text, we're going to go ahead and drop an image. And here's a really good opportunity for you to get really branded here, right? Maybe you take your logo and you combine your logo with something cool, or if you have a mascot or an icon, right? You can start to really enable your brand there. Or if you have something for VIPs, right? Put something like VIP or top fans, right? Really cool way to call extra attention to products that you want. And it's literally as easy as just adding an image. For example's sake, I'm gonna come over and use this cool cat image that we have for our image overlay. And you're gonna see, okay, well obviously this is way too big in terms of our positioning here. So a couple options you could do, of course you could upload a smaller image, but we could also control the scaling right inside of here, right? So we can come over here and do something like 20%, and we have different positioning over here, so we could say bottom right, we could say top left, right? Maybe we have a collection of products for cat lovers in an animal store, for example, and we could start having, I'll make it a little bit smaller, all the cat products quickly tagged with this image overlay, right? And this is a cool way to kind of, again, draw attention and funnel people. If you have people that are gonna be looking for cat products, funnel them there. If you have people that are gonna be looking for dog products, funnel them there, right? If you wanna have a VIP product or a new seller or a new release or any kind of custom badge that you create, just simply put it right in here. Right, you could change the opacity as well, make it see-through, again, padding, all the different kind of options. We can uncheck to not show it in search and collections. Maybe we just want it to be on the product page, or maybe we don't want it on the product page at all, and we only want it in the collection page. All right, so again, we have full control over setting all of this up. 
we can do some uh, padding as well to you see it's moving down in this case over here we can move it to the right a little bit so we have the positioning in terms of being able to set up things we have bottom padding not really going to be too relevant in this position where it is right now but again you see that this is moving in terms of how we want it to be positioned on this actual image and remember the really cool part the important part is that this image doesn't change in terms of our google feeds so we'll go ahead and save this one as well really really powerful right? really powerful when we have the different ability to have these really cool overlays whether it's text or whether it is image and then the image right you can go crazy do any image you want create your own custom image start having badges start having themes the sky's the limit with easy product image overlays now here's a really cool feature that I like. You see import, export as we click on that. This is the ability for you to export. Let's say you, th uh, you like some setup that you've created. You have an overlay that you really like. Maybe it's something with your top sellers or VIPs and you just really like how it looks. You could literally go ahead and export a specific product or a specific overlay uh, uh, title, or I'm sorry, a specific overlay uh, selection that you've created. So we could do only products with overlays. We export that CSV. Now we can come back at any time and import that same CSV. We can make edits to it. We can do bulk changes over there. Really cool ability to have that and really save it. So it's kind of like saying, okay, this is, uh, let's call it VIP style or call it top product style. And then all we need to do is simply import that style. Really easy for you to copy multiple products and copy styles all at once. You could also remove multiple overlays all at once as well by doing bulk editing inside of that CSV. So a nice power feature in this app but it's an incredible app because it's so easy to use and so powerful again you literally just click manage overlay and then you set up everything you see what you see is what you get let's say we want to go ahead and remove the top seller we'll just leave us with the cat image well there you go save just like that want to add another text we can go again put our position put our text put everything right inside there the app is super easy to use and super powerful. So that was easy product image overlays. You see the over the shoulder, incredibly easy to use. This is a powerful app though. It can really increase your conversion rate and create that funnel environment where you could really drive the attention exactly where you want with these smart badges. You saw you had individual control and branding over all of them. So highly recommend this app. You see the link directly below this video. Make sure you click that link, click the install button, get it into your store. And I hope this video helps you make some money. I'll talk to you real soon. Thanks a lot.